took advantage, came right to his playmaker, and converted big first down. Randy Moss has eight catches, though, two touchdowns. 900 now for his career. Maloney turns a loss into a short game. Broke out of a tackle, would be tackle of Gerard Powers. So Moss, great years in Minnesota, two years in Duluth at Oakland, and now the 11th player with at least 900 catches in NFL history. Russ Walker missed a couple of games earlier this year. Those two guys are on What are you the doing, Mick? Nearly impossible to stop this offense. People wondered if Brady was slipping a little. But as you see, he's missing his down. Second down, eight. Four man on. And he gets to Brady as he releases the ball. The ball is alive. Robert Mathis creates what for the moment would have been a fumble, but New England recovers it anyway as Copen winds up on top of the football. What are you doing, silly boy? Robert Mathis has just had a monster game on the outside working against Nick Casher. Watch the athleticism to jump for the ball. Good golly. He is the master of that strip sack. Oh, boy, yep. Yeah. Got it out before the arm was headed forward, too, so Copen saving it for New England. something special in your driveway this holiday. Get an exceptional offer on the Mercedes-Benz Uvalde's Mountain with a winter event going on now. The hurry, the offer ends soon. Hello, I'm a Mac. And I'm a PC taking you live to the Windows 7 launch. Hello. Hello, PC and Mac. Well, as you can see, there is upgrade fever all around me. Um, tell me, sir, how excited are you? We're really excited. We're finally switching to a Mac. Well, to, to a Mac, why, why? No question, I think the major reason why is the Colts don't run the football very well. You know, perfect conditions is what they really need to compete against some of these upper-level teams. Third and eight. sloppy game tonight for this Colts offense. We've seen Peyton miss some throws, we've seen miscommunication, we've seen drop passes, and you can't play a team of this caliber like that and win the football game. There's still time. There's still a chance for them to come back if they just make too many mistakes to this point. 36-yard attempt by Steven Wisowski. Nancy to put it down. And that will tack on three more and make it a 13 point lead. The win 34, Indianapolis 21. It's understood that if you get up to get a Budweiser, you come back with a round. How you carry that round is a matter of personal preference. There's the six pack strangler, the St. Bernard, the flock of geese, the marsupial, the shark.
Sure button, the claw, even the more advanced Labrador Retriever. But we always come back with a beer that starts with full flavor and ends with a crisp, clean finish. That's what we do. Jeopardy right now. The Patriots, the longest regular season winning streak in NFL history. They also have the second longest. And isn't it interesting, the top three are all in this decade, along with the Bears of Bronco Nagurski and Red Grange all the way back in the 30s. But 17 consecutive regular season wins in Jeopardy tonight because they're down by 13. Uh, Stavsky's pick was taken by Chad Simpson. Compare hundreds of travel sites at once. Kayak. Search one and done. Thursday, Parks and Rec inspires us to recycle and lessen our carbon footprint. Like catching a ride to work. Yeah. Those who don't get on board will be dealt with. Somebody shot me in the head! New Parks and Rec. Part of Green Week. Thursday on NBC. There's your quarterback comparison right now in a 13-point game. New England on top. Again, Indianapolis with all of its timeouts and the two-minute warning. Once you wait in this game, eight catches.